Yo, what's going on guys and welcome back to Designer Face Off, where we take two teams of four that literally just met each other with a two hour clock to then design a brief that they just learned just a few minutes ago. Now for today's brief, they're designing for a really cool music festival called Four Corners. Four Corners, the music festival is a digital experience across a four day event that harmonizes the pulse pounding beats of EDM, the raw energy of hip hop, the timeless vibes of rock and roll, and the heartfelt soul of country. Four Corners is looking to broadcast their festival via Twitch to showcase the variety of music and allow people to enjoy the sounds from around the world, hopefully conjuring new fans of genres they otherwise would even listen to. So I think it's be pretty cool but let's introduce the teams on the blue team we have isaac trace koba and vulcan on the red team we have frostify will room pratik and andro these guys will now have two hours to complete a logo starting soon screen a digital ticket experience lower thirds for the artists and one unique asset also judging alongside with me is george nowak and just before we actually hop in i just want to say don't forget the first link in the description down below the everything pack it is my personal library of custom handmade design assets, literally over 26 different individual projects, but also celebrated with my Discord community. That is a really, really fun environment to be a part of for other artists, supporting artists, and just getting critiques and all that good stuff. So it comes with a lot of dope perks, but also all free products on my store that release, you get for free, no matter the price. So three, two, one, start designing. It's been a minute. I a cannot long minute. even remember the last video we made together. Yeah, I mean, it all all that matters months. now, all that matters now is that we're here. I am ready to look at some cool designs today. Vulcan said he's a logo designer. My name is Luke, by the way. You guys can call me either or. So Luke will be designing the logo. I think we've got to keep cool. this one clean and sharp. We, we definitely want to keep it very like professional and minimal, kind of like, you know, it's a professional event as a whole. I'm willing to take the header. I'm willing to also take the stream starting soon or the digital ticket experience. The big thing is going to be just hit the brief. And if we can basically design something to hit every point, we're winning. That's basically how this goes. I'll make sure to make the logo and find a good typeface and also the colors with that. Let's see. I think I should tackle the starting soon because I can animate it as well. I think the easiest, most straightforward thing for me to do would be animated lower thirds. We're going to be judged by cohesion. So like, do we want the overall look of this to be very simplified, minimal? Like, I think we can go a little bit edgy. I could do the header stuff. I can create like, would you prefer to create the stream graphic from scratch or would you like me to mock something up and then shoot you? I'll go the from PNC? scratch for that because okay. um, otherwise we're just going to spread ourselves too heavily on one side. You know what I mean? I was also thinking for the uh, unique asset, uh, we could do like a, uh, like every time, every time people go to like these uh, big festivals, they always keep like the lanyard with like the the pass on or whatever i've been doing um stage visuals that actually is a really 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 good idea like a mock-up of the actual stage itself with maybe some graphics around it the really so, initial idea that i had about colors is to go like really vibrant let's run with this one for gradients yeah, we can go for a single logo mark let the colors and animation do the rest of the thing it will increase the cohesiveness of the overall project i think just like race simplified icons with like similar shape shape language is probably the move so the logo signifies like wavelengths like signifies the wavelength the audio and a monoline style also if you can see there's a person dancing oh oh wow okay that's actually pretty genius all right what well, are some good rap things that i can symbolize rap with i listen to it a lot i should know <laughs> i do too but like i'm just like it's hard to like <laughs> differentiate it from like edm a little like bit like you could do like yeah i see that like just do like a microphone maybe i'm happy to um, i i pitch a lot i'm happy to pitch if you need like i don't know an alley-oop kind of pick me up situation with it i'll just jump in i'll dm you be like help help <laughs> Not going well. Yeah, I, I like this a lot, but I just think it's too elegant. <laughs> Ooh, what if we mix them up? No, no, listen, 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 because it's full oh, connect, I, yeah. right? It's connect. I see what you're doing. Yeah, yeah no, no, try that. Do, try do that. one like square in this corner. Like... I think the I think the middle one is the best one out of out of those. The reason I chose middle was because it was more consistent, and we did talk about kind of feeling like more of a gamepad type of type of shape in the middle. I agree, actually. I think middle is where you want to go. Right, for now, guys, just build off of this, okay? Ooh. I'll put a screenshot in the chat, okay? Love it. Mm -hmm. Wait, guys, what do you think I should do for the... Like, do you think I'm hanging in the right direction for the starting screen or no? Maybe put a, uh, like, an example set list in the corner, like, like the upcoming sets and if it's starting soon. Okay, check this out. Let's run it with like 45 degree corners. Because we're using such sharp corners on the stuff, let maybe get rid of roundness altogether is what I'm thinking. I'm actually feeling instead of changing the physical 
visual motif stick with the spikes and then just change the colors oh like per genre that's a good idea because we got to do stage visuals as well and that's i mean once i've got this down like with that you know what i'm saying but what do you think what do you think like if we did like a giant because it also has bloom in it that's yeah, crazy that on it yes 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 just f grab it and do it yes is everybody like the overall feel of this so far well, you know how they have like maybe like a photo somewhere on the badge try adding that somewhere like you know, like maybe you could do it like kind of in like the middle photo manipulation skills are coming out guys the actual like mock-up itself doesn't have the natural bloom to it so <laughs> damn can we put lil sesso in there yes and then what about big george <laughs> One hour remaining. Are y'all feeling confident? How you guys feeling? I'm just glad that the initial idea which I had is coming to life. I mean, honestly, this is just a stacked team. Like we got this easily. We got, we got this, boys. I've never been more confident in a team to win this. Because every genre has its own color, correct? The white logo that kind of speaks universally, right? Which is kind of what we would want overall. Because white is every single color. What if we were to change like the four to the cyan? Because then we have all four genres here. Wouldn't yeah, that make like it a it. bit busy? Yeah. Well, I mean, I we keep don't the, keep the yellow text yellow. Maybe you can get some image treatment. Maybe like use the spike as negative space for like a crowd. Are we are we talking realism or are we talking like, like cartoon? Uh, like literally a photo of a music festival crowd. Awesome. Uh, how do we like the lanyard so far? I gotta add more to the badge part of it specifically, but uh, maybe I think the pirate should be a little bigger. And I, I'm almost wondering if the you should italicize the, the subheader. Don't think about the deadline. Think about the riches. Think about the success, the houses, the cars. <laughs> <laughs> no, you know what I'm saying, boys? Like, that's, that's... what you want to see. The vision. But I think long term yeah, is business. We're doing a like little, little Sesso, right? Is that what we're doing? And Big George. Big George, the headliner. This shit looks so fresh. Oh, you hello. Like oh, that's like... so nice. No, we <laughs> I know, tough. right? Frostify! You know what you're doing, my boy. <laughs> Hopefully, their ideas aren't worse than ours. We only pray. All right, we really gotta take a leak. You could probably do it, cause right now, like, you're playing the waiting game. You're waiting for us to wrap up the assets so you can throw them in. Anxiety won't let me go. <laughs> <laughs> but the name of that's funny. Carrot, golden, side glizzy, little juicy bird. Yeah, I know. I came up with them on the fly. I'm telling you. We want to give our customers the opportunity to unsubscribe, but as you notice, it's the smallest thing on the email. So, <laughs> and I think Will, the only thing that we're really waiting on is like the starting soon, and that's it. Yeah, that's gonna take the rest of the time, unfortunately. Dude, you're chill and don't even worry about it. He's gonna be presenting, by the way. IZK should probably, because he's building all the pitch deck, it would make sense. Um, okay, for sure, I'll do it. I'd be blushing and shit, we don't want that. Nah, we're not, we don't, <laughs> want, we don't want any stuttering happening in our presentation. No, I'm just kidding. No, that would be me, yep. 15 minutes remaining. I think we're killing it, dude. I think we're gonna cut it close, but I think we're killing it right now. I'm cooking, I'm cooking, I'm cooking. We cooking? Uh, look at oh, okay, yep, yep. I'm so stressed. That I'm forgetting the alphabets. Bro. <laughs> I'm just, I, we only have 15 minutes, so I can't do very much here. Yep, it's probably time to... Probably time to put it all together, boys. Bro, the fact I've made that that quickly. Oh, boy! Stop this shit right now. That is hot. <laughs> that is so hot. Who needs grids? <laughs> I'm pretending there's a grid. <laughs> I'm pretending. <laughs> yes, boy. Oh, bro, we won. I saw it. <laughs> We're ha I, I honestly, I'm pretty happy. I think we did awesome. I think we did great for the time frame. My gosh. Well, fellas, it's been a pleasure. Time is up. Stop designing. All right. So we'll actually have all the team captains now present their presentations so we can get a better idea of what they had going on. We decided to go with like a green and like purple scheme. Thought that would resonate more with the young adult audience as well as fit into gaming and streaming from the logo itself we really liked with different shape orientation and how that a lot of it represents excitement and also the corner circles specifically would represent unity and we also liked the shape language that we use just because as again we wanted to showcase the excitement of the event we also made some animations as well that also would help with the rest of the shape language and uh, the lower thirds specifically also were one of our favorites as well and we also liked it. I, I just want to quickly comment. I'm only a top 10 artist. That's what I am right now. 10 to yeah, the 67th, bro. Oh my God. You're not, you're not <laughs> even on the spectrum, dog. <laughs> All right, uh, Red Team, you're up next. What we decided to do 
was designed a, basically a branding system where things are sharp, things are energetic. Effectively, what we got here is also an abstract waveform. So obviously, it's like an audio waveform, but it's been sort of sharpened and, and youthified, if that's a word. If you see the hidden meaning behind it, there's a person dancing. For the mock-ups, essentially what we wanted to do was create a very inviting environment. We wanted to keep the branding it's super simplistic so it was easy to comprehend when people arrived. We're conveying movement, we're conveying exciting things like that, so our lower thirds need to convey that. Again, we're talking about audio, so it's motifs like sound waves coming from the corner. Four corners will be bouncing shortly. Just a fun fact that these spikes are animated on fours. The reason we've done it on fours is because that means that it's like four beats in a bar. So again, like subtle was like tied to audio. All right, no, you guys honestly did a really, really, really good job, but obviously we have to, we have to judge it, which means we're gonna break it down between quality, cohesiveness, and creativity. So I'm gonna go ahead and just, George, you ready to like, you know, go do the judging thing? Let's start off with the blue team. I think the logo does what it needs to do. It has like the, the hidden messaging with, kind of the the waveforms this definitely feels like this identity was made by a studio so every asset that was shown to us has a relationship to other assets i mean this is a very 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 strong option i think they convey the idea of excited very well with their movement the motion i think the motion does a very good job of helping out pretty much everything they have going on here so with that though we have the red team what are we thinking on that side i think it took me longer to see the vision will and frostby really killed the presentation all of the choices they made throughout these these two hours like made a very big impact on my impression and this is what design is about like a lot of it is just the pitch i really love the small details like in the animation even the the tempo of the animation being based off of like beats. That was very nicely yeah. put. Like that was yeah. attention on a different level, which is really, really nice. Even down to the logo, because at first you might think it's very abstract, but once you kind of point out, hey, it's also four corners, literally, and it's also the idea of an abstract person dancing. It feels a little more complete when you hear the reasoning behind it. I think their design style hits the audience section in the brief pretty much perfectly. Just for the record too, guys, you guys will have a chance to vote right here or in the description down below because obviously it's our opinions are cool, but yours is also cooler too. So definitely give it a vote. But uh, with that being said, George, the winner. If I were to pick which one comes out on top with those things that I had mentioned and the, all the points that you brought up as well, I would lean towards just for the record, there is no losers here. Just for, just for you guys at home, for the record, two hours. These guys did this in two hours. No more time than two hours. Even got it rendered in two hours of both teams. A little, a little, a little crazy. I just want to say congratulations on you guys. I think these these projects genuinely were like really, really cool. I would be excited about it, which means I feel like a lot of people will be excited about it too by majority. So like, I just think you guys should be freaking proud of yourself. But for the record, this game was was so close. Two points out of. 120 points that's how close it wow. was the champions of designer face i'm the third episode and it's already yep. it's already yep. too crazy okay is is the blue team so just for the record yes congratulations blue team you guys had a <laughs> overall points of 98 out of 20 red team 96 out of 120 so it was stu wow. stupidly close okay so again blue team though you guys are walking away with the dubs i think the cohesionness i won't even lie to you carried you guys massively blue team you guys are the winners that puts isaac koba trace and vulcan up there as as champions just, but just for the record I, I red team you guys did an amazing job let's go yeah. Let's go, there you go. We need that energy, yeah, baby. Let's go. Let's go, yeah, man. Yeah, you guys did crazy. You guys, you guys did definitely. You guys did. You got two hours is insane for the output of what you guys are doing. For the record, that's actually it's actually commendable. But for the record, vote yourself. What do you guys think? One, because my and George's opinion is only two people, and uh, I, I would love to see what the audience thinks. So if you guys rock with red team more, you vote red team. If you rock with blue team, you go with blue team. But with that being said. That is the end of our video here today. So design, it's not design around, design face off episode three is complete. Blue team as our winners. And uh, yeah, that's all I got. So HQ out, you gotta get a keep smiling, stay positive 
and stay freaking crypto guys and much love peace don't forget to check out george even though he doesn't post <coughs> as much hey, anymore I'm gonna, I'm, it, it, the next video is coming okay when it's on the way Okay. Working, okay. I've been you guys, editing it for a year. A year. It's gonna be the best video. Ever. <laughs> <laughs> Later.